F-35B Lightning Jets. The new frontline fighter that the Queen Elizabeth was built for. But they have never been tested together until now. With the aircraft married up to HMS Queen Elizabeth, we have a true strategic asset. Um, they have to be melded together for it to be a strategic asset. But with that, there's nowhere in the world we can't go and there's nothing we can't do. And the green flag is the D10. Stand by to take it from me, the director, the recovery director. Stand by to take it off me. These men are also learning about the F-35 for the first time. They are the aircraft handlers who have the dangerous job of guiding the aircraft around the deck. It's noisy work too, and they do it with a language all their own. Because we don't have direct communications with the pilots of the aircraft, we have to rely on hand signals, and some can change in an instant. So you've got to think on your feet. It gives the lads a lot more to think about and a lot more to do. When he's taxiing forward, we'll off brakes, and then we'll bring him forward. If we need to put any turns on, so if we need him to go left or right, we'll have to go to bring him left, and then the opposite way to bring him right. Aircraft handling is extremely hazardous, but surprisingly elegant and precise. Discipline, almost dance-like. The aircraft handlers in yellow are Royal Navy. So the jet took off from the 350 point. The ones in white are British civilian scientists responsible for the flight deck. Is there a particular reason why the re-rad is on? The ones in green are also civilian, American maintainers from the Integrated Test Force. The ITF is a specialist organization set up to deliver the F-35 for operation. The slick skin really makes it very futuristic. I've been doing this maintenance for 31 years now, and this is the first jet I really feel like they got it right. Yeah, the maintenance is very particular, but if you do it right, the jet lasts a really long time, and it flies amazingly well. There are nearly 200 ITF technicians and scientists on board and they monitor every launch and landing. Landing 65 level. Good way of flying. Right pedal, right pedal. They track and measure everything, right down to the pilot's breathing rate. 